Hi, sir. Hey, hi, David. Yeah. Yes. Um, so um, let me just turn my camera on. Here. <laughs> so my my doubt was, um, well, if you want, let me just explain really quickly. Yeah. So I applied for, for the job. I got the interview with the recruiter and it went well. Then um, they set up the interview with HR and the manager. Mm-hmm. And uh, that one went very well, I think. It was very long, like 40 minutes. Um, security company, I think. Um, mm-hmm. It deals with eSIMs and these technologies. Mm-hmm. But it's for an L2 uh, support engineer role. And if you want, let me share the, the description. Uh, you can share, no issues. JD, right? Yes. So oh, what is sorry, the question exactly? Yeah. Okay. Oh, so my question is, uh, the next thing is a technical round. Okay. Uh, I, I think it's breaking so in between. And it is. Okay. So, okay. So the technical round is, is your uh, next, right? Yes. Um, the HR uh, person said that it's the dynamic is they're going to ask questions in chat and I have to answer, I think, through chat. Mm-hmm. I don't know. I've 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 been through other technical rounds, but I hadn't uh, heard about that. I mean, so what what she is telling? She is telling that it's going to be more of a uh, like some kind of a practical they are going to give you during the exam. Means during the interview. Yes. Okay. So. Uh, Okay, just give me more uh, means uh, detail of this one, David. Then I can guide you. Okay, let me. I'll give you the the main functions of what it is that there. Um, the manager did ask me like, what was my disregard that last message before this one? So the one that says main functions is um, the manager basically asked me what was like my strong point and I said Linux. Mm-hmm. I mean, uh, I told them that I had configured, I have configured, um, because I have, I have configured Grafana, Prometheus, a node exporter, uh, dashboards. Um, when it comes to MySQL, I've done like the backing on the websites, the configuration with the name servers and all that. So I told him that information, but he specifically asked, like, what, what are you more uh, proficient at? And I said, Linux. So I don't know if it's going to be based on that. Then I think he's going to focus on some of the commands and mostly it's going to be on shell scripting. Okay. Uh, uh, because uh, when he's talking about some functions and all or... Uh, I know he is not going to ask you much, okay? But he is going to ask you to write down some kind of a scripts. That is for sure, okay? So in okay. that scenario, I would suggest that uh, don't uh, uh, make some some kind of a don't go beyond your boundaries, okay? Where okay. Uh, where he'll try to drag you, okay? So uh, okay. let let's try to pull him uh, like more of a manual commands first okay so the ad hoc commands uh, you say that i have executed find command i have executed uh, most of the like files command i have executed disk related command the partition related commands and all i have a video on that one if you wanted to quickly because our classes are going on david right so yes. i know it's going to take time uh, but in the meantime, since your interview is here, okay, and you have gone through my previous playlist, there also it is there. But those hundred uh, Linux basic, basic commands covering almost all the commands, okay. So just try to list down some 20 commands out of that which you can remember. And when he is going to ask you, you can quickly tell, okay, no, these many commands I know. So then he'll ask you, uh, just try to put pressure because in today's session i have explained so many things okay with the find command yes so yes. my suggestion is just ask him uh within when will be the next round is there uh tomorrow tomorrow okay so you do one thing please uh take your time today and uh, what all options we can use with the find command 
and what all options we can use with the grep command that please uh do with your full 100% this is my okay. suggestion okay? okay and uh, now don't think here and there okay so you can straight forward tell to him because i know very clearly in production environment uh most of the time people are getting struggle with or getting struggling with find and grep command so when you give him a point that i am very strong at find command and grep command then he is going to give you some kind of a scenario but what i have discussed just now in today's session it's covered almost everything david okay so now okay. what you need to do is you just try it out all m time c time a time with find command that is my suggestion and try to use grep command in all possible ways with all the options okay. please okay. practice this one thoroughly go in front of him and tell i am expert in find command and grep command okay and let him put his his questions i can bet okay. on that you will clear that round okay yeah i've been going over and over the 100 uh interview questions just going no, no, over no, them and going no, over that them. is that is something which you if you have to see when somebody is very specific with something okay then that guy is going to stick with those things right okay. so why i told those 100 interview question and answer when uh, you have to get a job so that you can get it no problem 100% but when that person is asking no uh, i just wanted to know when you said that i am good at linux so then he is going to ask you what in linux what you are good at you are further categorizing right you are for, yes. further uh, trying to dig into then you can say okay i am good in uh, in my organization i have done with find command these many things right you put yes. a you put your <laughs> okay uh, i guide you, him to what i know my domain yes, correct okay. so that is what i used to do it you bring him to your zone <laughs> okay okay so then he'll then he will not have, now he has to play with your cards not with okay. his cards correct so yes. that is the idea behind that one so i this i Got used it. to tell to everyone don't get into his zone bring him into your zone and let okay. him because if he is expert okay so what possibilities he can ask either a b c d or something like that but we have only e to z alphabet right so you try yes. out all the possibilities with find command within before tomorrow and with the grep command okay you will see the difference okay so this is so focus on that yeah you just focus on that because if we we'll fo- focus on multiple stuff then uh, the area will be bigger for you okay and uh, it's difficult now for you i am not sure what he is going to ask in those things right yes so it's better that you you just uh, make him round and round around the find and grep command <laughs> okay okay you say like i have created so many scripts with the find and grep command so ultimately you can put those things in the shell scripting i have already explained the basics of shell scripting with if then else statement correct yes. if we will get the something so you can use how you can use the find command see i have to find see here only if i'll share my screen quickly to you you'll understand what i just wanted to say here okay uh so there is one script the uh, the the basic one script the first script which i have created okay so if i do a cat of this script okay you see here uh, echo right echo something yes. okay so uh, cp uh, if i do this script into this one find logs okay in days older just see how i am operating david okay yes correct so it's it's like this okay let's go inside this one first let me clear everything okay okay v i am find right we are inside this one right yes. now just do a insert find this one right 
yes so you can take any of the command okay so instead of this echo you just print this one understanding and here yes here uh echo and we no need to give echo n just do a echo that's it mm -hmm. and you can see uh wait so instead of zzip you use ls hyphen lt rh okay and okay. Uh, just remove this one that's it so very simple and if you want to put it in some if else statement then you can use if okay the condition will be true then it's going to zip so it's going to validate oh. okay so like that okay yes. so okay. i'm i'm just mentioning here right okay that yes. makes sense okay mm -hmm. and uh, ls hyphen ltrh okay fine just write yes. and save var log correct yeah so i was mistaking it i thought let's clear this one sh and then execute this one right so here yes. as you can see clearly uh, we are able to execute the same thing with the output that these are the 10 days older logs right correct okay. so if yes. if is a condition you know if then else right if then uh, yes, yes yeah so you can put a so the condition if, is true then true. you can gzip correct so we can gzip this one right so that also we can do it understand my point david okay. what i just wanted yes. to convey here okay so just yes. try to uh, bring him to uh, your zone and then it's it's you can try so many things you just mentioned that i have done you go through all those uh, scripts whatever uh, i have mentioned during uh, uh, that playlist if you go through the playlist just use mm -hmm. those if then else statement with find and all uh create two three uh, scripts according to yourself okay that uh, which you can execute quickly if he'll ask then you can execute okay? okay so yeah but please stick with find and grip so 100% okay. you will be get successful okay right so i hope this clears your doubt okay Yes, yes, it did. Thank you so much for taking the time. No, no, no issues. Any, anything else, I can help you out. Um, no, no. I think that's that's okay. it. They said that was the last round. So after the technical interview, then if I pass, uh, they will see kind of like my level of expertise to determine the range of salary that they would be offering. Mm -hmm. So in that situation, uh, you'll also mention that with your expertise and please. when you are going for the salary i would suggest uh, ask them what is the budget okay don't just directly say something uh, that uh, uh, okay i i am expecting this much okay uh, because every uh, role has a budget okay even okay. if you hire a fresher also so there will be a fcr so these are the some technical things i am just telling you okay because we yes. used to hire on a regular basis so i know for a resource how much uh, there will be a tagging will be there okay so this is resource we need it in this much of budget so we have this much of budget okay so we need this resource uh, if if the hr will be able to manage below then okay so it's a win win situation for the organization and with the hr also right so she will get some kind of a right appreciation or something so this is why they okay. used to grill a lot okay so you need to straight forward tell no uh, could you tell me the budget for this role uh, what what i am going to work for so if they will say uh, we don't have a budget then you put your cards in front of them okay i want this okay. challenge okay <laughs> they will give okay. they will give okay 100% and okay. if they will say this is the budget so yeah i want the last digit of that budget only okay i want the full okay. amount what is wrong with that one so you give your best and uh, my best of luck with you 100% you'll get selected okay so thank you how uh, one last yeah. question yeah. um at the end of the of the technical round what should i ask to know um if everything went well if like what are the next steps what do you recommend to ask 
uh yes so in that situation you can ask him to get us to wanted to see that whether his response is positive or not uh i would say like uh, uh you can ask him like what is this role is all about uh, i know the jd you can uh, just try to tell him that yes i know the job description but i wanted to understand more about the role means what is my role uh, in the team or I- i'll be going to work as an individual contributor or i am going to get a team okay or uh, i'll be leading the team or i'll be handling something so he has to explain in that situation and you can also ask like what kind of a project it will be so if you can give me a kind of a workflow or i know uh, i'm not asking you to uh, discuss with me the project details but i just wanted to understand what is the project is all about okay and even you can ask whether it's a night shift and all okay uh, do i need to work on a rotational basis whether it's a 24 into 7 uh, uh, is is i have to connect on weekends and all okay so these questions are okay. normal questions we can ask okay and if he is interested if he is telling you all the details then you are good okay 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 so that okay. be there okay right, all right. thank all you, you so much and <laughs> yeah, no i will no work issues. very hard today okay no 100% god bless you and uh, god is there a supreme power is there i know and when we worked hard okay so there it will take some time but again uh, he'll see things and uh, uh, it will turn out in in your way okay things will be turn out okay one day it has to turn out right yes so keep doing okay it's there god is there okay 100% thank you vishak no I appreciate Bye-bye. it have Take a care. good night bye all the best you and too. give me a good news david yes <laughs> thank you okay. thank you bye, bye.